Yes, another video with us and we are just actually at home weekend for the first time we decided to do a do nothing weekend. We stayed just at home and we went out only to take Olivia's for walks and when we got groceries we wanted to take time to heal because I think sometimes we do too much. Just sometimes. <laughs> just sometimes. <laughs> Hotel that's 500 meters away from here. No, it's not about that. It's, only, it's also about like uh, we. You need to take the all the things for the baby. Yes. And then right. you have. Uh, if yeah. you have forgotten something, you're like, oh my goodness, I cannot survive. I'm going back home. Yeah. How much are we going to enjoy? Really? Yeah. <laughs> I think. Uh, I don't know. My my opinion. My on the matter was like, let's have a free weekend in which we say we are not doing nothing apart being with Olivia and have family activity. A lot, we got a lot, actually we got a lot of, I want to thank everybody to be honest because uh, these are advice they are from heart because people like Olivia and they want us to advise for the better for sure. Yes, yes, that is for sure. Somebody, somebody commented saying, no, I don't know why they are ignoring this issue. Why they're not talking about it? I want to address the comment or the idea that we are, why are we ignoring it? Why are we not addressing it? Why are we not talking about it? It's simply because for us, it seems normal. We have been with the baby with a white tongue all the time, and it seems just normal. Now about it, we are obviously parents for the first time. But, but, we yeah. went to the doctor. Yes. And the doctor say that if the feeding the baby feeds well, it's not a problem, because actually um, try to clean. Apart from the fact that Olivia is still uh, three months old, so most of the medicine they are for treating this problem are for four months or older. So we still have a little bit of time before we can treat the problem. But at the moment, is there, there, is no, there is no problem because the baby is feeding perfectly. And that was under a doctor advice that we said, you know what, since the tongue is not giving any problem, at the moment just let's leave it like that. Anyway, on the fall, on the, at the end of the fifth month, we are going to introduce solid food. Ah, okay. I thought you were saying the medicine. I was like, I don't no, want to come no, close. No, we are going to introduce uh, solid food. <laughs> So she will also, I have noticed something, since she started to explore uh, the world now, with also with the mouth, with the tasting, she's uh, licking basically every toys and so on. I, I think the, the tongue is getting better because uh, uh, it's kind of cleaning her tongue on her own. Oh really? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, you know, for those two weeks she cried and we kind of, the tongue didn't improve and at some point we just decided to stop. And we noticed that when we stopped giving mm -hmm. the medicine, she went back to drinking. The tongue was still white, but she was then taking mm -hmm. the milk. And since then, we just felt like if she does not give us any sign that she has a problem with this tongue, we shouldn't treat it until we see that there's a problem. After all, the medicine that we're given by the doctor, you know, it's just like off-label to use it. And again, our doctor also said to me, she wouldn't treat it because most kids would have this and would still feed normally. But if we wanted to treat it, we could take the medicine and that's why we took it. My experience, the medicine made everything worse because she was always drinking with the white tongue. But with mm -hmm. the medicine, she was not able to drink anymore. Mm -hmm. And for two weeks, we were traumatized. She cried all the time. We were getting exhausted. And now we kind of, sometimes we also panic and we're like, should we bring back the medicine? The tongue is too white. But no, no, not anymore. Not anymore. Oh, 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 oh. Not anymore. Yeah, a lot of saliva yeah. to swallow. But yeah, so... <laughs> I think she's still a little bit hungry. Yeah, yes, absolutely. She didn't eat enough, but she... 
and so now we just like even if she has the white tongue as long as she's feeding for us it's fine i have bought some stuff for cleaning but i just don't want to do them i'm hesitant about it like i feel why should we treat something that's not a problem at the moment mm, you get what i'm saying yeah so we have all the medicines as well i'm telling you in two months we are getting uh Solid. Solid food and then we are reducing the milk and then oh. yeah, the milk needs to be reduced. Oh, huh? Mama's milk is like a like a like. Why are we reducing the milk? We have enough milk. We should give more milk. Increase your milk. So you she can give more. Yeah, so she can also clean up the milk in the tool for me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's pretty much it. it for today is a short oh, video. I'm all, I'm all, I'm all. I'm going. Ah, 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 ah. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Get up. Get, get up. up, stand up. Stand up, give the ball to Papa. Give the ball to right. Papa. We're going to take a nap. Eh, eh. Ball to Papa. Ball. Yes. No, I really wanted my ball. I really wanted my ball. <laughs> yeah. It's so colorful. Uh, more, 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 more. So that's pretty much it from us today. Thank you everybody who gave us the tips. I think we'll, I will take those into consideration if I see... Huh? Yes. If I see that the child is not feeding well, then I will start with the cleaning. But for now, I'm just traumatized by how she reacted to the medicine and I don't want to do anything, if, especially mm -hmm. when she's feeding very well. Okay. So that was pretty much it from us today. If you enjoyed this video and you like to support our channel, please do subscribe and leave a comment. Uh, I want to hear if there's anybody here who have maybe experienced the child with a white tongue and didn't need to clean it and it was okay. I have asked a friend who also said, no, my child always has a white tongue, but most of the people on the channel obviously recommended that we watch the baby's tongue. And I'm open to it. I'm just hesitant now because she's still really fine and she's not giving any sign that she has a problem. Great. Okay, I'm already, I'm already the big one. So yeah. I'm warm up this milk quickly.